will be. No elbows that from size here. Release. No hit button. No and that it certainly no is. That roll. size difference okay. is over. T is 11 centimeters. Okay. That's several inches for those on the other side of the world in America. And the reach advantage is 13 centimeters, nearly half a foot. And there we go, Kabongo in the blue, Mars in the green. Kabongo, the circus freak from Suriname. Roger Mars, pot kangaroo, contains kangaroo DNA in his blood. And he's from Australia, of course. Wearing the traditional golden green of Australia sports. And the, uh, the stars that mark the flag on his right leg. Both fighters in orthodox stance. And, uh, starting a trade blows here in the first minute. You gotta imagine this is not gonna go the distance, can these two know how to concuss? Oh. They know how to knock out. Neither of these fighters have had fights that have ended in any way other than TKO or KO. Now my question is, uh, for Kabanga, who knocked him out? He said he has one loss. He was knocked out in the opening round of the Kubitai at our very first show by Andrei Zaporizhia. Oh, really? Yes, Zaporizhia, of course, was the man who Roger Mars knocked out of the Kubitai in the quarterfinals at Kubitai 4 in April. His only loss, of course, to Nobuyuki Hidoi. Again, 3-1, and one, all, all results via TKO or knockout. Big Kabongo, 2-1, and one, all of his results via knockout. And, of course, he's known for that vicious soccer kick knockout over Hiro Hiro Takahaka Hida at Kubitai 5. And they are trading blows. Punches circling. It's more methodical of a fight than you expect. I was expecting a big slugfest, but they're fighting smart. Now you've got to imagine somebody's going to be knocked out. Someone will be concussed. Oh, totally. Will it be cruelty to animals or will it be treating circus performers with absolute cruelty? <laughs> as, they, as they are tended to, both. Yes, of course. And Roger Mars switching to his southpaw stance. He can. It goes both ways. Didn't mean that. <laughs> they didn't mean that. But, oh, tight down! Unexpected takes down the big Kabongo. And that height difference is nothing when oh. you're getting pounded on. Oh. These two Ooh. to the stomach. Ooh. And Kabongo. Well, the height difference is non existent when you're on the ground. And Kabongo looking to try to get back to his feet. He's not used to some ground fighting. Oh! Very well reversed, a good sweep. And Miz is now on top, and he might want to stand this up soon as we get to the halfway point. Ten minute first round, five minute second round if necessary. It's the marathon followed by the sprint. Are they sponsoring us now? Who is? Sprint. Uh, no, they are not. In fact, I think we now have to pay their money for even acknowledging it. Damn it. You can tap a kill. Fine. Well, I guess we're not eating food tonight. Very descriptive, just food. Keep going. Yes. Just in general. Oh, yeah. Big Kabongo. Trying to get out of the butterfly guard of Roger Mars. Very nice. He played. Oh, switches over to side map. Oh, good oh. sweep, and Mars has him. Oh, back in the half guard. This isn't the fight we were expecting. We were expecting him to be do getting out of the ground. And there we see Kabongo standing up again. Oh, big oh. overhand right. Kabongo misses and a good counter. That's what Miles is going to have to do. He's going to have to get over that. Reach him out. Yes, he gets inside. Lands a nice right hand. Three minutes left. And Miles looking to work his way inside again. Can you? You're used to being with uh, larger opponents or larger uh, counterparts and having to get inside. Oh, and oh. like that! Oh, oh left hook out of oh. nowhere! And he's throwing him in the oh. face. Those kangaroo knees. Has to be it. Hande Sonata says no more! Uh. Kenta Makiri has climaxed! Uh. And we are nowhere near the climax of tonight's show, but Roger Mars puts a big punctuation uh. mark. I gotta put it in the bottle. Uh. 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 Oh. Uh. Uh. All right. All right, that's for later. Whew. So are you telling me, Ken, that, that entire Jug is your own. Or cycle. It's all your own, or is it like kind of a mishmash? Nah, it's all mine. What? Wow. Wow. 
Okay then, well Roger Mars, your winner via 2KO. And you kind of imagine that one of these two would have had to land one of those big strikes. It was going to be over whoever landed the first powerful strike and Roger Mars.